है गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल माय नेम इज़ नेहा आई एम अ मॉम वाइफ इफ़ यू आर न्यू हेयर प्लीज़ टेक अ मोमेंट टू सब्सक्राइब टू माय चैनल टुडे आई हैव क्रिएटेड दिस क्लैम मेकअप लुक यूजिंग ओनली ड्रग स्टोर प्रोडक्ट्स एंड आई रियली लाइक हाउ दिस लुक टर्न आउट इन दिस वीडियो आई हैव ट्राइड फ्यू प्रोडक्ट्स फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम एंड दे आर एज गुड एज हाई एंड प्रोडक्ट्स विदाउट एनी फर्दर ब्लैवरिंग लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो I'm starting with priming my face and for that I'm using my Elf Poreless Putty Primer. I tried this primer for the first time and I really like this. This is not drying on the skin at all and it fills in the pores very well and it also makes your makeup last long. And the best thing is it is very affordable. For foundation, I'm mixing my two favorite foundations, my Makeup Revolution Stick Foundation and my ColourPop Tinted Moisturizer. Makeup Revolution Stick Foundation is bit drying on my skin but it has a great coverage and my color of tinted moisturizer as the name says it's a tinted moisturizer so it has a less coverage but it is very moisturizing on the skin that's why i have mixed these two for concealer i'm using my milani conceal and perfect concealer this is also a new product for me i'm using it for the first time I really enjoyed this concealer. It has a creamy texture and a great coverage. Here I'm using my Real Technique sponge to blend the concealer into my skin. Then I'm using my Wet n Wild contour stick to contour my face. I'm using this stick on hollow of my cheeks, on my forehead, my jawline and on my nose. Then I'm blending it with my Real Technique sponge. Then I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me Loose powder to set my concealer and foundation into place. This is one of my favorite powder to use and it has a bit of coverage as well. Then I'm using my NYX micro brow pencil to fill in my brows. Then I'm using a big fluffy brush to remove the excess powder from my skin. Then I'm using my Elf Bite Size Eyeshadow Palette in the shade Pumpkin Pie and Truffles. Then I'm taking this light brown color on a fluffy brush and I'm going to blend this color in my crease. Then I'm taking the same color on a smaller brush and I'm going to apply this on inner corner of my eyes and outer corner of my eyes to create a halo eye look. Then I'm taking this dark brown color and I'm going to apply this outer and inner corner of my eyes but this time I'm keeping it below my crease. This is my first time using these palettes. I'm really impressed with the formula as the shades are nicely pigmented and are easy to blend and also very affordable as well. Then I'm taking this black color from Truffle palette on the smaller brush to further deepen the outer and inner corner of my eyes. Then I'm taking this big fluffy brush to blend the edges so that it looks smooth and diffused. Then I'm taking this gold shimmery color on my fingertip and I'm going to apply this on center of my lid. Then I'm taking this light pink color from the truffle palette and I'm going to apply this on the center of my previous shade. Then I'm taking my NYX eyeliner and I'm going to apply this on my waterline. Then I'm taking this dark brown color and I'm going to smudge this along my lower lash line. Then I'm taking this light brown color and I'm going to blend the edges of my previous shade. 
Then I'm going to curl my lashes with my lash curler. Then I'm coating my lashes with my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. Then I'm taking my Physician Formula Butter Bronzer to bronze up my skin. I'm applying the bronzer on all of my cheeks, on my forehead, on my jawline and on my nose. Then I'm taking my Milani blush in the shade Luminoso and I'm going to apply this on apple of my cheeks. Then I'm taking my Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter to highlight the highest point of my face that is my cheekbones, my forehead, my nose, my cupid bow and my chin. Then I'm taking my Milani Make It Last Setting Spray and I'm going to set my base with it. This is such a good setting spray, it really makes your makeup last long. Then I'm taking my Beauty Watt lip liner to line my lips. I got this lip liner in the subscription box and I really like the formula. They are very easy to use and very pigmented and very creamy as well. Then I'm finishing my look with my next lip lingerie. I'm going to mention all the shades in the description box below so don't forget to check it out. Here is the final look guys. I really enjoyed creating this look. I hope you also enjoying watching this video. If you did then don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching guys. See you in my next video. Till then take care. Bye bye.